So one of the main benefits of HDMI 2.1 is enhanced gaming. So Thomas Jan's going to take us through the main features to look for when it comes to HDMI 2.1. So here today we are dem demonstrating like two of the features that Xbox One X has enabled already. Um, these are two features, VRR and ALLM. Um, so VRR is variable refresh rate. And what that does is basically it matches the refresh rate to the content um, that's being produced. So typically a game, sometimes it needs to take a little extra time to render a frame completely. And so VRR will essentially um, make that transition uh, alongside and send that to the display and it enhances the user's um, experience of the game by reducing judder and then maintaining um, content fidelity, make sure that everything that the graphics complex wants to send to the TV or to the display gets to the display. Um, the other demonstration that we're doing now is also is ALLM. So ALLM stands for Auto Low Latency Mode. Now most TVs will have a game mode built into it and that game mode is designed to basically optimize the response time from the, the console to the TV. Uh, when the TV receives the signal, um, sometimes for like um, other content types, you wanna do a lot of processing to make it look better, but when you're gaming, you want the response time, the experience of the response time to be very, very, very low, um, as low as possible. It just makes the game feel better. And so what auto low latency does, or auto low latency mode does, is the console will send a signal to the TV to say, hey, please switch to your low latency mode. Um, so that it will basically do this automatically um, so that the user doesn't have to pick up the remote and fiddle around with it and select the mode and then unselect it when they're done gaming. So if they go back to another experience, um, the feature will basically switch back to the mode that it was in previously. Basically doing everything automatically and making everything seamless so that the gaming experience is really, really fluid and really, really optimized. So we're just trying to make everybody happy and hopefully HDMI 2.1 uh, we'll get a really high adoption with everybody and um, these features will kind of come uh, more and more into the fold. So these features are being introduced in HDMI 2.1, but as I said, um, the X Xbox One X is an HDMI 2.0 device right now. And so we've already been able to enable some of these features and we'll try to enable um, as many of the features that we can um, in this phase. And as 2.1 comes up, we'll get even more great stuff.